So excited, I gotta say. I mean, it's been about 16 months in the making here from about, yeah, a year and a half ago. Going down to El Paso and Juarez for the first time, seeing the kids, just, you know, getting into that place and the culture. And now here we are, 16 months later. So super excited and honored to be here. Matt and I had been working on a couple other projects and collaborated before, and he brought the idea to me and said, look, you know, there's something I'd love to explore the school. It's unique. It's the closest high school to the Mexican-U.S. border. And there's something going on here with, obviously, the election of our president and what's happening with the wall. So a confluence of factors got us down there. And once we got down there, understanding just how special that place was, meeting the kids, understanding really how sports was an anchor for them them and the uncertainties that they face throughout their life. But all those factors really pushed us forward into the project. Right now, I think to see these kids, the humanity that they represent for the Latino culture in the United States is going to help, I think, the rest of America see that there are hardworking kids down at the border when a lot of times people are vilified um, down, you know, in the Latino community at the borders are vilified in certain press outlets. So to see these kids really overcoming obstacles and see the humanity there hopefully inspires people and, and you know, senses an understanding of what, uh, is, what uh, America can be and what should be. It's first time at the film festival, so very honored to be here and be with you guys. I would hope so. I, you know what? I've been on another project, so I basically got off a plane in Los Angeles, onto a plane in New York, and really looking forward to, after our premiere, sitting down with the festival program and seeing what other, what other ones I can jump into.